What's up, everyone? It's old school Jeremy Woolward reporting to you live from the second night of my Carl Gotch Bible workout, where I thought I'd take it a little bit easier tonight, get used to the idea. I found the exercises I did, kicked my trash a whole lot more than I expected. Tonight, hearts were planks, diamonds were lunges, spades were kettlebell swings, clubs were kettlebell presses, one-handed kettlebell presses. Because you did double in the black, you can only imagine how many of them actually did. You'll see the you'll see the cards in the picture later on. Uh, so again tonight, quick little message before I do my uh, push-ups for my pal Eric, keeping my commitment to 200 push-ups in 10 days. I've had a chance today to interact with some pretty cool people. Namely, one gentleman out of Ontario, named name Tyson Dukes. Uh, professional wrestling fans will know him. But one thing I find really cool and fascinating about him is that he's so dedicated to his craft. Watched a sequence that he did with one of his students today about chaining. So the idea is why you move and holds flow naturally into each other. And I thought that was kind of cool for us amateur guys recognizing where to move, how to move, how to flow from one technique to the next, that takes a lot of practice. And unfortunately, sometimes it's not in style. I remember as a referee, so watching people actually wrestling, and it's okay, let's have a sumo match and let's see if you can get the zone and step out of bounds for a point. Well, that doesn't work. You gotta wrestle in the center, you gotta stay active. And it's total wrestling. Read a rule book, they'll talk about total wrestling. There's no giving up, there's no stopping. Anyway, Tyson in his world, he pushes a restoration of uh, old school catch wrestling into his game, into his, uh, into his work. And I hope that I can do in our world what he does in his. So just know, I might be a little tired now, but uh, when old school steps on the map for real, you're going to be working hard. You can try and beat with technique, but you're not going to say I'm gonna be, you're going to tire me out first. And then when I take you to the mat, and I put your shoulders to it, and hold you there and pin you like I mean it, and the ref blows a whistle and slaps the mat, you'll know that you just had a wrestling clinic courtesy of old school Jeremy Woolward. Well, that's the goal. There's a lot of work to be done to get there. Fair I share it with the world. Now, without further ado, here's my 20 push-ups for the evening, and then I'm signing off. with that have a great night take care stay safe one love work hard get stuff done cheers